Hi, and welcome back to Clearwater Muffler and Break. I'm George, I'm the owner. And today we're going to do a, uh, a brake inspection on this 2011 GMC Terrain. And uh, as you see, we got the wheels off the car already. And we're going to mic up the, uh, the rotors. We'll get out the micrometer. And we're going to mic them up with this machine here. And we're going to measure the thickness of the rotors. And we're going to see if they're cuttable or not. Okay. Now what we're going to have to do is get into these grooves where these pits are. And sometimes they're cuttable and sometimes they're not. Alright. Now as you see we got seven, seven, six, point five. Okay. And then this is what we do, we'll mic up all four wheels and then we'll check it with the book and we'll see what the specs are for cutting, for discard, for run out and we'll see if they're uh, serviceable. Then also what we will do is replace the brake pads. Now these brake pads are down a little bit low. I wouldn't have went this low but some people go down. And when you hear that ee 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 noise in the car, that's a sort of warning device. What, what it does is it rubs up against the rotor and makes a squeaking noise and it's telling you it's an indicator to let you know that your brake pads are down low and they need to be replaced. Some cars have sensors on the dash, some cars don't. But this cab will never let you down. So when you hear that squeaking noise, that's an indication of a low brake pad. And that pad should have been replaced a while ago. Okay? 